What if I told you? Hey guys, happy Friday, y'all. I literally just pulled my um surgical head off, so I'm trying to get myself together. But yeah, I am off work early. It is 12.57 and we're about to go to Walmart. Um, I've been eyeing this Bible for the longest and I'm going to go pick it up. So yeah, I'm going to take y'all with me and then I'm going to get some sushi. I'm going to call in some sushi as soon as I walk in Walmart. And uh, yeah, I need another Bible because my other Bible that I have is like so... Um, like it's big and it's heavy i'll show it to y'all when we get home but like sometimes like in the mornings is like that's my quiet time on the way to work that's my quiet time with like god and stuff like that and sometimes like i just be wanting me like a bible that's like easier to tote easy to just carry around than um my um big one so yeah i'm gonna go get this one i've been eyeing it for a minute like i said so yeah we're about to go get it your girl needs some gas because i'm out here trapping it out without none and i don't want to have to call roadside or anybody to come so yeah but i will see y'all in walmart y'all they got some new native look at this look at this one yes. Y'all, I am so sorry I didn't vlog in there. It's just too much going on. Like, baby's crying. And I was trying to show y'all native. And this lady just comes up. People just so rude. Anyway, we're not going to get into it. But y'all, I got my Bible. And this is what she looks like. When I tell y'all, I've been eyeing this Bible for like weeks. But I'm so excited. Like, I got it because it's so, uh, I feel like it's such an easy carry. This man looking at me but whatever but i feel like it's such an easy carry y'all and she's cute so yeah a motivational monday okay okay but anyway i just called my sushi in and the lady said it was gonna be 20 minutes so that's just enough time for me to get back in traffic get out of traffic get gas and get back in traffic to grab me some sushi so yeah y'all i'm so glad to be off work i'm definitely about to go home and start studying and stuff so yeah but i will see y'all probably when i get to the sushi place so y'all i just got home it is currently 2 24 so yeah we are going to check out this bible together so yeah i think i showed y'all so i'm not gonna show y'all the packaging we're just gonna open it and uh, yeah so it says on the outside that um words of christ in red faux leather um gilt edge pages full color maps um 14 point type cover can be personalized presentation page reader friendly subheadings and all of that good stuff oh i was gonna show y'all my old bible let me get my old bible for y'all hold on one second let me let me grab my old bible so y'all this is my old bible and it is the beautiful word coloring bible and it's just so heavy y'all can't really tell you can see how thick it is so you may be able to i love this bible i've had it since 18 and i like it but it's just so it's heavy it's heavy so that was a welcome change and now that i'm doing motivational monday and i'm so inspired your girl I had to get a bible okay but anyway, this is the KJV version. Um, the cover price was $39.99, but it rang up for <clears throat> $29.99. And this is it. This is her. She's leather. She's pink. She's cute. And she's got the little tabs, as y'all can see. And yeah. And this is what she's looking like on the inside. So cute. 
And yeah, when I tell y'all these words are huge, they're huge. So yeah, I'm definitely, definitely about to start highlighting and going to town. I can't wait to do my motivation on one day with y'all in my new Bible. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I do want to um, <clears throat> grab some tabs and stuff because sometimes when I'm doing my motivational Monday, I have like more than one scripture. I think on my last, let me bring y'all down some. I think on my last motivational Monday, I had like two, no, I had like one scripture, I think. And with this one, I have several. So yeah, I'm so excited y'all about my brand new Bible, y'all. I can't wait. I can't wait. I'm about to go right now and get ready for motivational Monday. So yeah, girl. But anyway, I'm about to just chillax. I just got done eating and stuff like that. I'm about to chillax and do a little studying, watch some Tubi. Y'all, I'm crazy about Tubi. I love me some Tubi movies. I love, love Tubi. And yeah, that's it. It's early. So I'm just going to relax. So yeah, I'll see y'all. In a little bit. I hope y'all are enjoying your Friday too as well. I hope y'all have a great, great weekend. And yeah, if y'all going to these Super Bowl parties on Sunday, y'all be careful, okay? Be careful, but yeah. I'll see y'all when I'm doing something. 2,000 years later. Hey guys, so I just woke up. It is literally, well, I'm in about 30 minutes, but yeah. I am, it's six o'clock. I'm about to go and grab some ice cream because I have not had my, I haven't really had my sweet treat for the week. So yeah, I'm about to go and do that. And then just come back home and chill. And um, probably watch TV. I've been asleep. I don't even know how long I slept. I think I slept for like maybe an hour or so. I don't know. I really don't know. But anyway. Y'all, so since I've been eating right, I've been trying to lay off like um heavy sweet stuff, you know, whatever. So I just been getting like plain vanilla ice cream, like just a small dish and not getting like um, the heavier side of stuff. So yeah, I'm gonna start my workouts back tomorrow. So yeah, but I'm about to go get this ice cream and yeah, I'm trying to do more vlogging, even if that means I have to vlog and talk to y'all from the house, okay? So, but yeah, let me get up, throw on some shoes, and I'll probably see y'all in a little bit. Y'all don't have any gas in my car. So, do this one got a door dash? Because <laughs> your girl is lazy. Your girl is lazy. I'm going to have to eventually get gas, but... I don't want to do it tonight. I don't know. Should I just door dash it? I don't know. No, we're not going to door dash it. We're just going to go get gas. If that's the case, I can go get pineapples from Kroger. If I go to Kroger and get gas instead of ice cream, huh? I don't know, y'all. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. I'll call y'all back when I figure this out. Peace. One thing about me, I'm gonna wear my house shoes, y'all. After being up on your feet all day, you know I am. I'm not trying to wear no um shoes. This truck don't even see me, but I see him.
so it is a little bit later in the day it's like 1 i'm about to go and get me something to eat and then um come back home and yeah just chill out for the day oh god let me my hair is all over the place hold on y'all let me turn the tv now i don't know i love me some blue street y'all i can watch this movie every time it come on like literally every single time it come on but yeah we're about to go and get some food so i'm gonna take y'all with me excuse my hair it's just been in a messy bun all day because it's just giving that kind of weather so yeah that's what we're about to go do and yeah i'm just chill out for the day i think i already let me not show y'all my laundry basket because i gotta wash but it's just been that kind of day it's on me i'm sorry but yeah oh gosh i'm hungry y'all when i eat this late i literally don't eat again don't eat again. The only thing I've had was pineapples at one o'clock because my fasting was over at one. So, yeah. But I'll probably see y'all when I get to Sunny. Oh, and another thing that I do too is I like take my bread off and I eat um, the Sara Lee Delightful. Let me just show y'all what I'm talking about. <clears throat> so, this is the bread that I eat. Um, it is the whole wheat. The honey whole wheat and it's 45 calories a slice. I need to change that in my um, <clears throat> weight loss app as well. But yeah, I'm about to go out and I will see y'all when we get to Sunday. Hey y'all, good morning. It is Sunday. It's currently 7.57 and yeah, we're about to be on our way on our, at the door. It is raining outside y'all and whoo and they talking about it's supposed to be storming and today is also super bowl sunday so i want to go and grab um some raw tail dip which i'll probably make on camera but i don't want it to be storming and y'all know we have to walk like so far as like to get to the church so i'm hoping it don't be raining but y'all i just got on this simple sweatshirt with these black leggings and we're gonna throw some shoes on so yeah i want to stop by duncan and grab a coffee before church so we're about to head on that way and i'm gonna also look for an umbrella because i need one when i tell y'all i love this bag i love this bag i got all my stuff i hit myself in the face i got all the stuff in here this morning because it's raining and i don't want to Mm -mm. Deal with it, but yeah, so I'm about to get ready to head out because, like I said, I do want to be able to get coffee this morning. So, yeah, I will see y'all a little bit later. So, let me just tell y'all one thing about me I'm gonna leave home in time enough to get Duncan before church. Yeah, I used to wake up on Saturday mornings, that used to be my little thing. I forgot my cup. Uh, anyway, that used to be my little thing that I did for myself on Saturday mornings. But now I just like, if I go get my nails done on Saturday, um, I go grab my coffee. But girl, I do it on Sunday because that's my little treat. And y'all, last Sunday, I um didn't. I went to the eleven o'clock, which I normally go to like the nine thirty. But and I stopped by Dunkin'. And the line was like out the driveway. So I was like, no, we're going to start back going to our 9.30. Number one, because I just like going early. I used to go to the 8 o'clock when I stayed closer. But yeah, but I also went to bed before like 11 o'clock also. But anyway, I'm just rambling on y'all. Happy, happy Sunday. I hope y'all had a good weekend. If y'all going to any party tonight. Make sure y'all please stay safe, okay? Because I love y'all so much and I want y'all to be safe. But yeah, I will see y'all when we get to Duncan Bay, okay? Y'all, it looks so dark out here. Ooh, oh my gosh. But we're going to church, boo. Thanks to the doctor. 
Um, yes, can I get a caramel iced coffee with almond milk and light ice? Caramel iced coffee? Yes. Um, with almond milk, light ice? Yes. And can I get it with a uh, sweet cold foam? What else are you? That's all. 439. I'm gonna let y'all sit right here because at least I'm parked and I know my phone won't fall. But I'm the only car in line today. I'm the only car in line this morning at Dunkin', y'all. I was mad I didn't get my coffee last week though. What you have, baby? Uh, the medium caramel iced coffee. Not her kind of feeling herself. Y'all, I didn't want this coffee to be uh, too sweet. And it don't look sweet at all. It don't look sweet at all. Thank you. y'all the coffee so y'all this is what she giving and she don't look sweet at all but anyway yeah so let's just see before we pull off mm. oh that's good mm. i like my coffee to still have that coffee taste so it's so good but yeah i see y'all when we get to the house of the lloyd Y'all, let me just say this real quick. I'm so glad I did not get my coffee with sweetener because I do it a lot. But I'm trying to break that because I don't want no extra <clears throat> added sweetener on my end. And when I tell y'all, it actually hits. It's hitting. Like, I like for my coffee to be sweet. Like, it's got to taste some kind of sweet. I don't want it black. But, like, it's got that coffee taste. And one that's one thing I like about Dunkin' is that, what is this on my seatbelt? That's one thing I like about Dunkin' is like, I still get a great coffee taste behind like the flavor. And that's what I love. So yeah, okay. But anyway, anyway, y'all, that's, that's my rant, that's my rant. <laughs> church and it was really really it was honestly really really good and so we are doing our um p28 series at church and the thing that i like about it i don't know if y'all i forgot if i talked about it in a vlog or in a shorts or whatever the case may be but Anyway, hold on, let me wipe y'all. Um, P28 is 28 days in February, but because it's a leap year, it's 29. So that's why it's 28 plus one, P28 plus one. And not only do like, I like the fact that he, you know, is saying, hey, we're gonna, you know, pray for at one o'clock every day but he's giving us the tools and the essentials that we need to pray and today he was talking about you know when you're praying you know ask god like what is your glory what do you want me to get out of this you know and he was saying you know he was praying you know for someone but god shifted his perspective and he was saying that sometimes it takes you Sometimes it's not the thing. Sometimes God got to work through you and change you before he allows you to change, before he changes, you know, 
whatever it may be and like i i cling to that like i hope to that i love this church y'all i absolutely love this church i've been going to this church since like 20 i don't know maybe like 2016 or whatever and i love like every single moment of it like i've cried so many tears at this church tears of joy like it has got me straight on my faith and i just i love it like he is just i i i I love it. I, I love it. But anyway, I'm headed to Walmart right now to pick up the stuff for the Rotel. So, yeah, my heart is just so full this morning, y'all. It's it's so full. It is so full, y'all. It's so full. But oh, God is working. He is working. Okay, okay. I'll see y'all in Walmart. I'll see y'all in Walmart. fall y'all will stay up there for just a quick second but y'all i need to be slapped i need to be slapped let me show y'all what i done did yes y'all i done bought another notebook why why do i do this to myself i don't know if i went in there and i was like mad because i didn't have like a notebook for today in church but look at her look at her she is so cute literally so cute and here's the inside i need to be slept and these are the pens that i love y'all i got the needle tip this time but it's the same the one that i have this time um before these are black i don't even know if i let me see if i if i have them i know i was writing with it today in church so this is the one that i love to write with and stuff and this is the one that i have it's pretty much the same brand but except this one is the needle tip so I can't wait to use it. It says smoothest writing ink. So we're gonna see. I like pens that make me wanna write, like that make me wanna take notes. And this is just her. And not only that, it just, it might be my mind, but y'all, it just helped me to like write prettier. Like it's just, it's that notebook. And it's, oh, I always get the 0 0.7 metal tip, y'all, 0 0.7. We was talking about this. It's so crazy how you get older and like you're, taste for things change but yeah i always pick up the 0 0.7 um needle tip yeah yeah but anyway i'm about to go home i'm probably not gonna start cooking um just yet because it's just now 11 16 and i didn't even pick up nothing to eat and i'm probably not gonna eat nothing i'm gonna just continue my fast i don't eat till like one o'clock and i mean i just got like what an hour and a half or almost an hour and a half so yeah but i'm gonna pick y'all up when i get ready to um start my rotel and my meatballs y'all i'm scared that i don't have enough um barbecue sauce for my meatballs but we're just gonna go on faith and y'all did see me pick up the turkey meatballs because it's just me eating today by myself so yeah i'll see y'all probably a little bit later when I get to cook you. Hey y'all. So I am back home. I'm just gonna show y'all what I got um from the store. No, actually y'all seen it, but anyway, y'all gonna see it again. It is fine. It is fine, but I picked up cream cheese. They didn't have um 
the one block so i had to get the two block and y'all i love the cream cheese rotel i don't know what kind y'all like um uh, but i've been making this so long i don't even blink at the velveeta no more i'm just like girl whatever i picked up turkey meatballs because like i said it's just me so pick those up i picked up some chips and scoops are my favorite the little dippers these the little dippers they're my favorite i picked up some rotel i got the mexican style and lime cilantro Oof. and i also got some tennessee pride so i don't want to cook with no other sausage in tennessee pride like especially when you're doing it with the cream cheese because your meat and your cream cheese is key but yeah i will see y'all probably when i get ready to start mixing this is which is going to be a little while later so yeah i'll see y'all when we get ready to start cooking